Now we're going to talk about trends, whether you're into florals or ruffles. You're about to see how to stay fashionable all spring long. Lori Bergamato of People Style Watch is here with the hot trends. Hi, Lori. Hi. We're going to talk about five trends. Yes, we have a lot to get to. Beginning with floral. Yes. Kathy, come so on our, down. So our first model, Kathy, is in floral. And the floral trend is so great because it's very feminine. It's all but about... This is subtle. This is not like your exactly. out there ball flowers. Yes, yes. It's all about a small diffused print. So it's not those big Hawaii Five-0, you know, sweeping <laughs> florals. No hula shirts. Exactly, no hula shirts. This is a small diffused print. And what we love about this dress is that it can go from day to night. This is from Billabong, it's only $52. And it's a one shoulder dress. So if, yeah, you can see oh, underneath, we threw beautiful. a blazer over, but for night, it's one shoulder, subtly sexy. And we just love this whole print because of its feminine but modern interpretation. Now the thing is you don't want to mix your floral prints. Right. So what we did on our model is we gave her a cute little ring. If you want to really, if you like this trend and you want to participate in it, just little accessories are the way to go. Very nice. Okay. Thank you, Kathy. Paige you. is sporting the ruffle trend, which I love. I yes. love ruffles. This would look fabulous on oh, you. Thank you. Um, this is Paige and this is our ruffle look. This is a um, cupcake tank from J. Crew. It's $44. And what we love about this is that it's no fuss tears. It's not like big like ballerina tutu ruffles. These are soft cascades, it's very grown up, very sophisticated, and you can see what we did here. We paired it with a pencil skirt. This is something she could wear for a night out. She could wear it to work with a blazer over it. Or this can replace that white ribbed tank top that every woman has in her closet as the go-to piece with jeans. It's casual. You can wear it with anything. Anything. Absolutely. And, and under 50 bucks. We love that. Love it, Paige. Thank you. Thanks. Joy utilitarian trend. Utilitarian. This is one I feel like needs a little explanation. Yes, please. So what you're looking for with utilitarian is a few things. You're looking for cargo pockets or zips. Toggle pulls. You can see on Joyee uh, the metal snaps down the front, right. the drawstring waist that's cinchable, and the tab pockets, um, the tab sleeve pockets on the side. That all makes up a very industrial style aesthetic. And that's what this look is. It's sort of that uniform but workman style. But it's still style. feminine. She still looks and very girly. Thank you for noticing because it's rendered in a silk fabric. So it's sort of dressier and it balances that toughness with a very feminine look. This is from Banana Republic. We mixed it with skinny jeans and fried boots. Okay, thank you very much, Joy. Shirley, come on out. Sea, sand, and hobo trend. Yes. A bag is hobo. The bag is hobo. Everyone always wants to know what the hot colors are. It's sea and it's, it's, sea and it's sand. Think surf and turf. So this is from American Eagle Outfitters, it's only $29. And what we love about this is you can participate in the trend, but still be casual. Women think you have to get all dressed up. You don't. You don't, it's under $30, it's casual. We paired it with jeans, and you can wear blue with jeans. Just stay about two shades away from your blue on top. Oh, that's good advice. Yes. I love and then it. we paired it with sand. We, we mixed two trends in one, the sand and hobo bag. So the sand color is so big, it's beige. You know, everyone's looking for a recession-friendly buy, and this is the thing to invest in because it goes with everything. That color, you can wear with everything. It's a real wardrobe workhorse. And the hobo bag, they're big, you can fit everything in them. I love hobo bags. This is from SR Squared, and has that braided trim. So I'm gonna right. tell you a little bit more about hobo bags. Actually, no? okay. we're out of time, but okay. we quickly wa do want to mention the fifth trend, which yes. is neon, yeah. which you're sporting. I'm sporting. Go with that, too. Just very 80s. It's very 80s, but a pop of color. Just a shot of adrenaline for your wardrobe. We're going to talk more about hobo bags since you wanted to on the website. Please go to cbsnews.com, earlyshow.cbsnews.com, and Lori's going to have all her style tips.